Damn, 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 bro. How's it going, everybody? Long time no see. First of all, before I get into starting this video, I'm going to go ahead and say that I didn't film any videos with Cam. I started filming one, but like we didn't do anything. I don't know. I haven't. I don't really broadcast my life the way I used to. It's, it's kind of cool. Like I just I don't know. I live my own life, and then I film the stuff I want to film. None of you guys give a shit. Anyways, today, 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 I have some work to do with the FRS. I haven't really filmed any videos with this car yet because I've been traveling and doing a bunch of stuff but I am here for the next at least a month maybe more so I may as well start fucking around with this baby yeah also I'm on my big camera just because the quality is a little bit better it is it appears to be working usually it just cuts out but if it's gonna work I'm not complaining oh my god dude she's filthy <laughs> not that little turtle wax can't fix Damn, okay, so for like 10 minute shitty car wash, it's not bad, it's not bad at all. Obviously, I could definitely fuck up a pressure wash, but I didn't feel like driving the flagship today. Not bad though, not bad. White car problems, bruh. This bitch gets dirty so fast, and I'm just never pressed to clean it, but like, I should, I should, I should clean it more. <laughs> I would like to take this moment to give a very, very massive shout out to Rexing Dash Cams. These guys, they actually saw the video I posted when I got the car, literally a few hours after it went up. They hit me up and they were like, yo, like, the new car is sick. Would you be interested in like, promoting our dash cam? Just stress the importance of dash cams, and like, it's just, a good safety measure and it's really nice to have in the car, just always better safe than sorry. So right now what we're going to be doing is, I have the Rexing Dashcam V3 Plus. This thing is sick, so I can shoot 1080p, but it's a two-way camera, so I can set up in the car and essentially vlog, just like camera set up in the car. Let's get to it. This is the good right here. Oh, that's beautiful, look at that. That is just beautiful. And in here we have all our cables and even a pry tool, that's nice. Okay, so insulation is actually pretty simple. So, oh, so hot, dude. I don't want to sit in this car right now. Oh my God. I was hyped when I saw that Rexing hit me up for a dash cam because I was actually looking to get one just because like, it's just safe for having one. You capture everything that happens. If you get an accident, you can prove what happened. And like, I've actually been in a scenario where I was rear-ended and obviously the person that hit me was trying to be like, no, it was my fault when like, it really wasn't. And I didn't have a camera to prove it, but now I, We'll be able to prove it. <laughs> so the camera's gonna go right here. I mounted the mounting point on the right side. I'm gonna wait like maybe 10, 20 minutes and put this bad boy in. And as soon as that's done, all I have to do is just plug it into the cigarette lighter and we should be good. Oh boy, oh boy, I'm scared. Every time, man. It's so loud. Hey, stop beeping, stop beeping. So it's actually been like an hour since I last picked up the camera and I actually just got a haircut, so cool. Yeah, unfortunately, I can't use my car charger anymore, but lucky me, I have a cord I can plug in. I have a CarPlay head unit, a new amp, and I have a sub on the way, so I'm gonna have really good sound in here. The Beamer, the one thing I liked more about the Beamer was it had a kick-ass sound system and this car, it, it's, it could be better. Camera, camera's in place. I'm sweating up a storm, bro. It's so hot. You know what? I'm gonna turn the car on to slide the AC. Okay. Camera is mounted. Now we just connect it, and I think that's all there is to do. Wiring's gonna be a little ugly for now. I'll tape it all down later. Oh, look at that. Just like, oh, damn, bro. Look at that. That's, like, that's kind of sick. So you can see, you can actually see me too. Damn, that. That's pretty sick. All right, so I'm working on my shifting. It's pretty good now. Uh, it's, it's not a Gavin Bay Go. It's not amazing, but like, it's not bad. <laughs> uh, 
So it's actually the next day. I'm sorry I didn't really film anything yesterday. Right now, I'm going to hop in my car. I'm gonna head over to my friend Dima's house. Not Dima, the trampoline guy, Dima, the car guy. You don't know him, you're about to meet him. He's got a Beamer too, he's got a newer one. Putting new fenders and a new hood on it. So I thought, you know, like it's be cool. I can go check it out, pop him out. And unfortunately, I have to put this bullshit back on the car. Just for a day though, because the car actually failed state inspection for the lack of a muffler. Bruh, really? And once it passes inspection, I'm gonna take it right back off. Oh, uh, why do we, just why bro? This is horrible, this is sad. We don't need this, but we kinda do. Ah, uh, uh, okay. Oh my god, it's hot as fuck. Tesla drivers, bro, I'm telling you, like, what is that? What is that, bro? Stop. We've pulled up at our uh, undisclosed location, if you will, where we're working on the Beamer over... I, I think that's it right there. My man's has two fucking Miatas, bro. And they're not like, so like boring ass Miatas. Like, these are sick, bro. So, got this red one right here. And the thing that caught my eye with this one is he's got a fucking rip and dip sticker right here. If you guys remember, I actually had the exact same sticker as like a little air freshener in the last car. And I have their shoes and all. That's what I call, actually one of my favorite brands. Brands? Ooh, damn. Dude, this makes me want a Miata. Fuck, did I buy the wrong car? Bro, what the fuck? That's actually crazy. Small wing gang. <laughs> Bro, we even got the, oh my god, this is a fucking godly setup, bro. That's insane, that's actually insane. And my man's don't have, he don't just got one, he got two. Damn, bro. It's like, quite fuck. Bambi. Oh, <laughs> uh, yeah. <laughs> my friend had some fun keying shit into the car, because, like, you know, everybody wants to know what it feels like to key a car at least once. Um, oh, okay, you can't even see it on camera. Bambi was here. <laughs> just hold it, I think it's good. Uh, there we go. Yes, sir. Now she's in. And then there's a nut on the windshield over there. Yeah. Just, yeah, get it on there. Alright, I'll do the rest with the wrench. Ooh, yeah, look at that. Really Actually lined up. <laughs> God. We've been working on like trying to get the fenders and shit lined up for probably like I mean I think I've been here for like two hours now We're making progress, but I don't know if it's gonna be done today The time has come to finally start working on my car though Unfortunately, dude, it's gonna sound horrible after it's done, but it's only for a day. So it, it could be worse So the issue here is these two bolts, I think you can see them right here, are rusted as hell and those are the only two bolts that connect the lack there of a muffler onto there. So we're just gonna try and get those off slowly. We took off the wheel. You have more access. Wheel's right there. Um, nice. I have to pick my balls. Damn bro, sign me oh, up. Let's go, Dude, we're making progress. <laughs> Big man's Willem just literally did all the work for me. I've just been sitting here. So, to- Show me your hands. Yeah, I, I did a lot, you see. I, I lifted up the wheel, and so now I'm gonna get Simba just because. <laughs> Jesus Christ! Making a little drink run, just me and Willem in the fucking. Bro, this golf is fast as hell. I've been in like once. Oh, I'm excited, dude! I love this car. Let's go! Corona. The determination. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm short shifting. I've seen so many cops today. Third year, 4,000 RPM, flooring it. <laughs> I was 
way late saying to 70. <laughs> 70 like not up. As a matter of fact. Fucking chest. All wheel drive is the only reason why I can downshift mid turn. Yeah. noise off the trees that's why that sounded so good oh yeah so yeah. i made it back and oh damn look at this look at the progress oh, I where just made it non -PG. nah dude I, I curse in the videos now and go all the little kids that used to watch my videos are not little kids anymore big dogs yeah y'all some big motherfuckers now <laughs> <laughs> oh so look we this is where the, right, the muffler muffler joint originally plugs in and obviously we're taking the pipe out now I'm gonna start it once with no tailpipe at all, just for the hell of it, for like five seconds, just just to make a statement, you know. And then we gotta put the muffler on. It's gonna sound like a Dyson vacuum cleaner, but it'll it'll sound like this. It'll sound good again tomorrow. In the meantime, while we was out doing that little drink run and shit, good man's Dima, bro. He went he went to town, bro. So originally he got this whole bumper that he was gonna replace it with, but he said, "Fuck it, you know what? I'm gonna just work my magic." This actually looks good as hell, dude. Bada bing, bada boom, <laughs> baby. Just stitches, bro. Nice. All right, so look at that. Their muffler delete is out, and now it's there's obviously no tailpipe. I, I'm apologizing to everybody now. Is it gonna be loud as hell? It's not that bad. It sounds the same. Dude, it sounds better with the pipe. That was kind of disappointing, I'm not gonna lie, but unequal length headers will, will make the difference. So, quick little comparison while both the pipes are out. This is loud pipe, and this is vacuum cleaner pipe. And honestly, like, like this whole side of the pipe is kind of useless because the sound just travels through this part of the piping and it just shoots out the right side of the car. The left side, like, it, you can hear stuff, but it, it's all the right side doing the work. So I'm considering just getting rid of this side, honestly. I don't know though. Fuck, I realized I probably should have filmed what I just did. I, there are four hangers to get the muffler on. I got the two on the right side, which sucked, but now I have to do the left side. And because it's already sort of in place, it should directly be easier. Time to find out. Uh, yes, one more. Oh, bet you're almost done. Let's go. All right, bitch ass, where you at? I think the last one. Okay, that's all four. Uh, okay, now I just got two both left. Damn. So I, I think the SD card might have crapped out on me, but I, I, I did it. Now it's stuck. <laughs> and now is the the sad moment where we we hear the vacuum cleaner. I have I've never heard it with the muffler actually. Oh, no! Oh no! That is disgusting. Bro, the car is like wimpy now. Like this is uh, I I can't even like like if I got on it. That's so sad, that, that's so unfortunate. Okay guys, it is now day three of this video and I just took my car to inspection and lo and behold, this baby passed. Let's go. So, I, <laughs> we passed it like 20, 30 minutes ago and we're already putting the other lack of a muffler back on the car. It's, that's how it's supposed to be. Up, 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 up. Oh no, the sunglasses are falling. There they are right here. Ah, uh, ah, uh, achoo. Oh, look at that, we're done. That was, yeah, like, I, I stamp every time you do work on your car, the first time is a bitch, but if you do the same job again, it, it's so fast. Yesterday, it probably took like an hour-ish. Granted, the bolts were rusted as hell. This whole swap took 10 minutes. <laughs> nice. Just to, just to make sure it, it sounds okay. Like, sorry, neighbors, it's, I mean, it's three o'clock. You should be awake anyways. <laughs> more like it. Uh-huh. 
Uh-huh. That's what it's supposed to sound like. Okay, so we got all that done. I think I'm gonna go ahead and end this video right here because it's about it's gonna be a big thunderstorm and it's gonna be crazy. But car's out again, it's we only like going right from here, boys. I'm telling you, I just gotta make some bread. I gotta I want headers, I want lowering springs, I want new wheels, new tires, all that stuff. But for now, like it's a good starting point. We got a lot of work to do, but I'm very excited for what's coming in the future. If you guys stuck at the end of this video, you're awesome. I really appreciate it. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe if you're new. And that's all I think for watching. We'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.